Mr. Bobcats, this is Allie and Xander with your Bobcat Blaze News. Today is Friday, October 11th, 2019. It's a day two of our schedule. Now to Daniela with birthdays. Thank you, Allie and Xander. Happy birthday today to um, Evelyn Handy and Dean Renner. H happy birthday to Emily, Amelia Lutz, whose birthday is Sunday, and happy birthday to Isabella Lippincott, whose birthday is Monday. Also, happy birthday to DBK teacher, Mrs. I, whose birthday is also on Monday. We hope you all have great birthdays. Thank you, da Daniela. The weather today will be mostly cloudy with a high of 62 degrees. Tomorrow will be partly cloudy with a high of 69 degrees. And Saturday will be partly cloudy with a high of 65 degrees. I hope everybody enjoys this weekend. And now, back to Ali and Xander. Thanks, Aiden. Our takes for a team of the month is acceptance. Here's a video about what acceptance is. <laughs> Some students sharing how they show acceptance to others. Hi, I'm Naomi and I ac accept others by let letting them play with me when they ask and being kind to them. My name's Nolan and I show acceptance by including my friend Julian from his injury because what at one of the fo Penridge football games I made sure that he was always with us in the crowd because it was trouble for him to walk. My name's Sam and I show expectance when if, if I'm playing on the playground and a girl wants to play with me, um, I let them play with me. My name's Kaylin and I show acceptance by always including others. Hello Bobcats, I'm Aiden with shout outs. Here is some teachers sending out shout outs to their students that show acceptance. Hi, this is Mrs. Johnson in fifth grade, and I want to give a shout out to Lily Beck in our class for always being willing to accept people into her study groups, into her reading workshop groups, and making sure that everybody has a partner. Great job, Lily. Hi, boys and girls, this is Mrs. Peterson, and my shout out for the month of October goes to Grant Henry. Grant is always somebody that I can count on to do the right thing in class and he will take whoever his partner is and he always includes others. So shout out to you Grant Henry. Way to go. Hey Bedminster, this is Mrs. White. I just wanted to give a shout out to Room 10, my class, because you guys have been doing an awesome job being accepting. You've accepted substitute teachers and we've had a new student this year and you accepted them, and that new student has also accepted all of us, so great job. It's so great to see Bobcats being so accepting of others. Now to Gemma with special news. Thanks, Aiden. Character Counts Week is coming up October 21st to October 25th. Remember, kindness matters. Tutors today are Gianna B, Eva M, Alexandra S, Samantha P, Amelia L, and Urexi. We hope you've started logging your minutes for our Fanatic About Reading program. Here's a video telling us more about it. Welcome back to our daily talk show and please welcome our hosts, Dean Benner and Kylie Wheatley. Hello ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to our daily talk show. Now please welcome our guest, Bryce Harper. Wait, where is he? I don't know. He should be here. Where could he be? Uh, close the curtains! Close the curtains! Why are the why curtains, are the curtains closing? closing? Helen, why are you reading? Because I want a Philly fanatic to come to I our still want to know why the curtains didn't close. Oh, okay. What is taking so long? Let's come sit down and we can talk about it more. Okay, I'd still kind of be re rather be reading, though. What was that, Helen? N nothing, sir. So, Helen, why exactly are we all reading? 
The Philly Fanatic will come to our school if we read enough. Oh. So, basically what you're saying is, if we read enough minutes, we'll get the Philly Fanatic to try and, we'll try and get the Philly Fanatic to come to our school? Yeah. Well, okay, so to earn this reward, we all must start reading. Kindergarten, as well as first and second grade, must read at least 15 minutes per night. But third, fourth, and fifth grade must read at least 20 minutes each night. But don't forget, it's always good to read more. The more we read, the better chance we have of getting the Philly Fanatic's attention. He might even come to our school. Yeah, how long did you guys read last night? 35 minutes. About 45. I read about half an hour. Well, to track those minutes, you'll all receive a calendar. The calendar looks like this. You track your minutes in each box. So if today is the 8th, then you'll write how many minutes you read in the box that says October 8th. You it's will very get simple. You will get a new calendar every two weeks. And don't forget to have your parents sign it. Gee, this is so, this sounds really fun. Yeah, let's all does. start reading. Let's all start reading. Let's read. And let's get lots of minutes in so Philly Fanatic comes to our school. That was really informative. It would be great to have the Philly Fanatic come to our school. Now back to Ali and Xander. Thanks, Gemma. As we all know, our book fair is going on right now. Here are some pictures of the fun Bobcats are having picking some awesome books to read. Because Bobcats love reading. <laughs> believe in ourselves. We don't give up and we always do our best. Remember, Bobcats, be the reason someone smiles today. At this, this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance in a moment of silence. Bye! See you next week!